Hey YouTube! So if I'm completely honest, I had no intention of recording this video, but I decided to switch on my camera because I am in the midst of using apple cider vinegar to um, cleanse my hair and I've done this section here at the back and oh my goodness, it just feels so good on the scalp so I thought I need to share this. I know Probably most of you that are watching this video have probably looked at other videos of people doing apple cider vinegar rinse so it's no big deal to you but to me it is because although I've watched people do it I've never actually done it for myself this way. Um, I did do it once where I just kind of doused my whole head with it because I didn't know what I was doing but then I decided to look online and actually educate myself on how it's really done and the best way to do it is in a applicator spray bottle so I've got my trusted spray bottle here and I just put 100 millilitres of apple cider vinegar and mixed it with about 300 millilitres of water and the brand of apple cider vinegar that I use is the Bragg's, the one that everybody uses, the organic one that has the mother in it because that's the best type. It has the most, it's you know, it's been through the least amount of um, processing to get it in from the apples to the bottle. So you retain lots of the um, nutrients in the mix. So yeah, and um, as I was saying, I've sprayed this bit and I've massaged it into my scalp and it just feels so good. Words cannot describe how I feel right now. I could actually go to sleep. That's how soothing it is. So how I'm actually doing it is I'm just kind of trying to expose my scalp. And um, because it's so cool, you can feel it going on. So I just kind of spritz my scalp with it as much as I can. And then I'm just gently just rubbing, rubbing my scalp to dislodge all the build up from my scalp. Um, I'm going to take care of my strands afterwards but I thought I'd go around my whole head and just take care of my scalp first so that's what I'm doing and it just feels so good honestly if I close my eyes and I pretend I'm laying in a spa somewhere and somebody else is actually massaging my head for me that's exactly how I feel right now I mean the only downside to this is the stench, it stinks, it's like, to me it smells like, if you're British you'll kind of know because you know how we love fish and chips, it, it smells like, you know when somebody's put too much vinegar on their chips and it just stinks, yeah, and you wrap the, say you buy a portion of chips and you, you, you know, you add some vinegar to it and some salt and then they ask you if it, do you want it open or closed and you say closed and then you wrap it. But then the distance between the chip shop and your home is like a million miles away. So by the time you get home and you unwrap your chips, it has that stench. This is it. Yeah. And my hair just feels really really soft it's just amazing it just it just all it just automatically changes the feel of your hair yeah just makes it really soft and just really manageable I could do this all day if I didn't have anything better to do I could just sit here all day and just basically just massage my scalp with this stuff but, um, obviously that's not possible so, yeah right so I'm gonna keep going and I'll come back when I've finished doing my scalp to show you how I do the actual strands okay so I've finished clarifying my scalp and now I'm going to tackle the actual strands of my hair so for that I'm just gonna <clears throat> release one of the four parts and just basically spritz it with lots more of the vinegar mix just saturating it and then I'm just going to run it through my hair but it should be able to just do its own work 
there's no need to kind of ruffle my hair too much. Oh, honestly, if there was such a thing as smelly vision, you guys would be passing out by now. The stench is just, it's so overwhelming, but it's not the worst smell in the universe, but it's pretty bad and pretty close to it. Okay, so I've done my whole head. So, um, yeah, so this is my whole head and I've got this much left of the mixture. So I'm gonna just carry on spritzing my hair, the rest of my hair with it. So I didn't even need that much anyway. There's no way I'm gonna finish this whole bottle. So I'm pretty much soaking wet now. So I am just going to put a plastic cap on my head and let it sit in my hair for about two to three minutes. And then I'm going to go and wash it out with a mild shampoo. And yeah see how we go so I'll be back so hi I just want to show you guys my results I finished washing out the apple cider vinegar from my hair I just use a really pea sized amount of really mild shampoo so the Shea Moisture Black Castor Oil shampoo I just used that and just squeezed it through my strands I didn't really rub it in my scalp because the apple cider vinegar had done a really good job of clarifying my scalp and just lifting all that build up um, and because I use like mostly natural products I don't have like loads of gunk in my on my scalp but you know it was pretty like um, you know pretty oily from all the products that I have been using and yeah these are my results and yeah my hair is clean it's looking so shiny there is nothing in my hair at the moment guys I've just washed everything out so I haven't even put my leave-in in yet and look at that I mean look it's just really shiny my scalp is as clean as it needs to be so yeah all in all I think apple cider vinegar and as for the smell by the way yeah I mean <clears throat> it kind of smells like a very faint but I can see that that will dissipate in the next few minutes so I'm not too bothered about that so um, yeah so I can go ahead and just style my hair as usual so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope it's helped you if it has please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you soon in the very next one bye bye mm -hmm.